Hey guys, welcome to the channel. Thanks for joining me. It's been about three weeks, almost three weeks uh, since I've been out on the water. I'm super, super excited to be out here today. Don't really have a game plan. I'm just, I just had to get out of the house and go in between storms. I may get wet, so hey, that could get interesting. But man, it is so cool to be back out here. My tow vehicle has been down and uh, just not been able to get out and go. And uh, finally got that going again. And now I'm on the water, super excited. Don't even care what I catch. I don't have a big elaborate plan to do certain things. I got some big baits. It's summertime. A lot of times I catch big fish deep in the summer out here. Um, got a drop shot if that doesn't do well. I got I got some moving baits. Got a crankbait and a fluke if I catch some busting fish going on. So goal is just let's put a fish in the boat and uh, enjoy a pretty day until the thunderstorms get here and they are coming hang out with me i'm gonna put one in the boat before long you guys hang and we're gonna get one see ya all right guys check this bad boy out right here this is the second one i've caught the rain has just quit the second good one I've caught off this one point, I've caught quite a few small ones. Uh, my largemouth was bigger than this one. I, I only got a still picture of him in the net because it was raining. Get Mr. Spot back where he goes. Wow, the rain turned these fish on. It's been a long day. It has been very enjoyable but the bites up until it started raining were kind of few and far between uh, just to be honest a couple little bites early and then not much going on storms got to moving in had to had to bag up my cameras basically for the and I'm gonna work my way back to the ramp and the thunderstorm kind of went north of me even though it was still raining i i couldn't get my cameras out but the fish <laughs> the fish turned on and made the whole day worthwhile i've caught uh four four bass in the grass on fluke i'm trying to keep up with this in my head so i don't mess anybody up I'll tell a story Four on a fluke in the grass while it was raining. Um, I think four on a drop shot, including one, probably three and a half, four pound large mouth. And then that spot, probably that spot just now was pushing three pounds. And it's still sprinkling, but I had to get that one. The sun's come out on the other side of the lake. It's still sprinkling on me. So I'm not gonna, I think you can see back, back behind me, I got a worm bag on my other camera and I'm fishing to bag this one back up. Can't, can't take a chance on running a camera just over a fish, but man, it's been a long day. Didn't get much of a video shot. I may work on this in the, in the studio and do something with it. If so, you'll hear all this. If not, it'll just go away and I'll have some steals, but right now I'm rain free, just barely sprinkling. And uh, there is schooling shad everywhere. As soon as that rain quit, you can look all across this lake and there is shad. Man, they're just, there's a school over here, school back here, school to my left. There was one off the point across and I don't see them right this second. But man, when that, as soon as that sun came out and the rain ended or the, the heavier, the shad all just hit the top. 
and that school's coming back so i may get i may get another one out of that if this sprinkling will quit i'll i'll be able to run both my cameras for a little while and may end up salvaging salvaging the day anyway hang out i'm wet but i have had a blast it's so good to get back out on the water and uh i'll let you know if i grab another one